Okay, this is just a quick video on the electromagnetic spectrum. It's going to help you uh, explain some of the uh, reasons why we can't see this on, uh, with our own eyes, but why we can see it when we point it at a camera, um, and, that, and why your TV can recognize the, the remote control. So we're only able to actually see the visible light in the electromagnetic spectrum. This is the whole spectrum. There's loads of different types of light, but uh, visible light is the one that we can see uh, with our eyes. So our eyes are only sensitive to that range uh, of the rainbow from uh, red to purple in color. Anything lower than purple on the, the spectrum, UV light or X-rays or gamma rays, we can't see those because they're too high frequency. Um, the next picture actually makes it a bit more clear. So ultraviolet rays, X-rays, and gamma rays are too high frequency and we can't see those. And then infrared radiation or infrared light, <clears throat> microwaves, and radio waves, we also can't see those uh, because they're too low frequency. But um, our camera on our phone and the camera on the computer can see uh, the infrared light because it's a lot more sensitive. It's able to pick up uh, a little wider range on either side of the visible light spectrum. So the infrared light that's coming from the remote is uh, just outside of our visible light spectrum. We can't quite see it with our own eyes, but when we pass it through a computer, uh, we're able to see the infrared light because it's lower frequency and the camera is more uh, sensitive. So that's a bit of information about frequency, uh, how fast the light is traveling, and uh, the visible light is the only the stuff that we can see because it runs from uh, purple to red, the, the colors that we see around us. Um, <clears throat> you may have actually heard people say that blue light is really bad for your eyes. That's because it's really high frequency light uh, down here at the end of the visible light spectrum. And same with ultraviolet light, that's what's coming from the sun. Um, the ultraviolet light that we get is also damaging to us because of its frequencies. And same with x-rays, if you have too many x-rays in your lifetime or in a small period of time too, uh, it can be bad for you because it damages your cells and things like that. So that's a bit about the electromagnetic spectrum. Uh, hopefully that helps you explain why the camera can only see this, but it can't see, uh, our eyes can't see it.